that people's belongings. People live there. They got 10 minutes notice to grab what they can. And now sanitation in the city is just throwing everything away and they're not being offered support or housing. We all want clean streets. We all want homeless encampments gone. Criminalization of homelessness, sweeps, they just push people around and they have no choice but to come back. And it's taxpayers, you all pay for this. This is cruel, it only makes homelessness worse and it's a waste of taxpayer money. See the official came with Christmas and said, okay, they wasn't going, they, they, they wasn't, wasn't coming today. But then all of a sudden, they gave us 10 minutes to get our stuff and get up out of here. In 10 minutes, we couldn't get all our stuff together. And not only that, but they didn't start on this and they start on the, in the center over there at another tent because they say he was bumping his gun. They not offering any services. They just tell you, get your stuff. You got 10 minutes, 9.55, we're going to start. And that's what they did. They grabbed a the bulldozer and they came in and started grabbing stuff, scooping it up. And the officer was right with them. You see the buggies? You can only make one trip in. When they come out, they go back in. Everything else you had to bring out of there, you know what I mean? By hand. That's why we wasn't able to save a lot of stuff, because they wouldn't allow these buckets to go back in. They only gave you one trip in? One trip in. Oh my gosh. That was it. We try to save the most important stuff, paperwork, IDs, and all that stuff. They don't look through it. They just scoop it all up and throw it away. I have to get another ID. I have to get another security card. Big car. It's, it's, it's a hard thing. Uh, are they offering you any housing? No. And then when you leave off, they'll come on the block, right, and they'll rake all the property up. And people was losing ID, people was losing medication, people was losing their sleeping gear that they had to sleep for that night, right? And then once again, when the lawsuits were filed against the city, the city was found uh, liable in court, given injunctions, but do the city follow injunctions? No. They just keep trying to twist it, turn it, bend it, and amend it anyway. The criminalization of homelessness is growing across the country. This is extremely expensive. Los Angeles, $70 million a year. And if we don't speak up, this is going to grow. Sweeps are gonna grow. The criminalization of homelessness is gonna grow. And with homeless numbers increasing because of the lack of affordable housing, I can't imagine what the streets are gonna look like in the next five years. That's why you need to contact your legislators now and tell them that all this taxpayer money being allocated to sweeps and criminalization needs to go to providing housing and services that help solve homelessness. Visible people no more. Please join our community on Patreon.